everybody, I am back. I am back, I am back from the vacation, or gradcation, or whatever, gradcation, is what I call it. Not in grad school yet, so, uh, I went ahead and got my, uh, schedule for the fall done with. It's going to be a less work extensive, so, at least for this summer, I can't promise in the fall, I'm doing the season by season. At least for the summer, the plan is to come out with videos Tuesdays and Thursdays, and those will have video game stuff. I got one already uploaded, and it's just going to be releasing to tomorrow at 12 noon Eastern. Um, and then Wednesdays, I'm kind of late by two hours, but I hope I get up in time. Uh, I'm going to put out the art stuff. Um, I like uh, keeping it down to four pictures so I mean characters so I'm gonna keep it down to four character drawings for whatever I rather cut it down and get out more high, high quality art than try to force five because by four I'm just like man just like I need a rest so and I feel like I really hit my stride with this fourth picture that you will see so um and then I'm thinking Mondays or Fridays I would do like life stuff so I'm thinking I'm obviously going to do social issues and stuff but I'm thinking I'm going to since now that I have my first bachelor's degree I feel a lot more comfortable and giving out tips and stuff on like things that you need to consider with university and college now that I've actually gone in and gotten a uh, degree I'm actually going through a program I have two degrees technically AA and a bachelor's and I just got accepted to finish out my second bachelor's degree and I can technically finish that in the spring but I'm going to take the scenic route and um, finish it in three so I'll be I'll be um, graduating again next year August and then hopefully be coming back uh, to do grad stuff and then I may be able to do tips on that I don't know um, but yeah so your boy's got a, got a bachelor's degree He's finna be earning him a second one, so wish me luck. Um, I feel like I am improving, especially with the faces. For, cause they used to be really bad at female faces. I feel like I've gotten better, at least for anime faces. Cause I, I'm, I'm, I really like how I did the Catwoman, and I really like how I think like I'm fine with the DC uh, female faces. You know, there's always room for improvement. No one's perfect, but. I feel like I do those better than um, anime girl faces. I think because there's like too much negative space. Um, but yeah, this one is Master Roshi. So I feel like there's too much in, in anime art. I know there's too uh, there's a lot of negative space on the on the art. I mean on the face. And so my struggles with the face tend to, now it used to be the mouth. I don't struggle as much because anime mounds and anime don't put much detail in their mounds as anime artists as they put in as uh american like dc marvel put in for the other characters like i hate to say it i mean just my observation i mean it depends with some stuff and then there was some like the um statue of god that one took a lot out of me with the mouth that one was like ooh, i don't even know how you even did that i don't know even how i did that i probably have to go back and look at the uh, video because I have a um, time lapse of that one too. Of oh, uh, Shin Shin Il Sang, I think is what it was called. Shin Il Sang. But anyway, this is Master Roshi. I have to redo that whole left side. But that being said, that aside, um, so I stayed for I stayed out, I stayed away for let me see. I left Saturday, Sunday. Left Saturday night, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. So a little under ten days, and then I rested yesterday. I was when I got home, I was out. I went to sleep. I was like, I'm gonna go ahead and do the art stuff and get it done and get it on. You have to get it on time. Yeah, like that was gonna happen. So my oh, so I stayed for about a little under ten days. And guess what dies? My my garden gets hit. So I lost a tomato plant. I lost a tap soy. I lost lettuce. And I lost my radish. 
not my reddish, my di my white reddish or whatever they call them, daikon maybe. Yeah, I think it's daikon, what I was wrong with. So, I replanted the straw, I mean, I'm sorry, well, technically I did that, but I didn't actually get a sprout out of that one. That one was extremely weak. But anyway, um, so I replanted those three. Um, the re but everything else came back was fine. I mean, the parsley, the old man, I call it the old man parsley, the boss parsley. Um, I had to snip out three or four stems because they were just straight up yellow. But the rest of it has stood back up. The other parsley that I'm growing has just blew up. So I think some plants love it when I don't give like they they like it when I don't give them much water for, for very long. And some other plants is like you need to be you need to be watering me like less than a week. So that's my master roshi. So I, so the tomato and tassoy are easy to grow. But they are not water hardy, water resistant. I don't want to call it resistant because you want they, they're not trying to resist water. They're not that hardy. Like they need their water and their nutrients if you're going to grow them. You got to be consistent. So I know I can't leave more than a week when it comes to them. I don't. Uh, yeah. So that is what that is. I might. Cause my mom definitely wants the lime. Now the lime it blew up and less of the week. Those that small little. That small little um, what do you call it? Uh, it was like a little uh, little bud on turned into a big old big old leaf, and I was putting out more. I think it grew like an inch in a week. Good lord! <laughs> like this, like the limes love hardship. I noticed that they love hardship. Like when I left it alone during the winter break, I mean, you know, it didn't sprout anything, and I come back from winter break, and it like dang. And it could be because the roots are not so deep, so the water is just standing in there. Now, it is a drain. It is, I believe I put it in a draining uh, pot. I have to check. I don't know. But, so I do think that the water is draining. I could be wrong. I don't know. I don't know. I forgot. I know the, the orange parts are draining. So, I, I definitely know when I put in enough, more than enough water in the, uh, in the pot itself. So, I don't know. Maybe it's just one of those like like in that in the, you know that that one independent sibling that just doesn't get much direction to do stuff. So it's like that. The orange is growing, it's growing slower, but then again, it's like one or two months younger than the um if not three months younger than the lime. So I'm not gonna expect it to be that big. I am getting the case, at least out of the orange, where it is cloning. So what that means is I'm getting two plants for one seed. I'm gonna leave it alone because I don't want to harm, you know, harming both trying to get rid of the other. I figure with uh, as it gets bigger, eventually one of them will just go away as the roots get deeper and basically, you know, I don't know. I may snip it when it's younger. I don't know when it gets older. I don't know. I don't know. I have to look at what I'm gonna do with the um, orange clone. The lime before I left was starting to clone, but I think it died back. So I, I think it went ahead and decided to keep with the main giant stem. The radicchio got bit, got fine, got fine. Surprisingly, the arugula was able to survive. Now I did see a little bit of browning, a little bit of weak, little flimsy, a little bit. But it's vibrant and green and whatnot on the main on the main stem. So I'm just like, you go ahead. I went ahead and put out some more strawberry seed. Uh, I don't know if I'm growing sage. No, timer sage or something like that. So I think I got two pots where they're growing both sage and thyme. So I just put thyme seeds in the one that just has the sage growing. So I have two pots that are growing the two same plants. So. It is what it is. Oh, also put in lettuce, new lettuce. Um, I ran out of the prize head, so I put in some Grand Rapids variety along with the Black Seed Simpson, which grow like trees. Ugh. Or tree-like. Almost like a flower. But there's like no pretty middle to it. Different color middle to it. This is the one I'm most proud of this one. Master Roshi. I like all four of them, but Master Roshi and Akihiro Atlan, which is this one, or Adelin. These are my most proud ones here. Could have darkened the hair a bit more, but it's just like, well, if I really wanted a black, I could have got a black color pencil. This was when I think I was trying to, no, I was doing a reference. 
there's gonna be a little break on here and I was trying to find my pencil so that pencil was at Jacksonville I keep leaving things at Jacksonville I got my razor back from Jacksonville so I don't have to have that big old giant bush for beard anymore I had no excuse I could do it for free and cut my beard for free now when I have to worry about the individual razors and I think at this point I was looking for yeah at this point I was looking for um yeah I tried a big one that didn't work I went with a, I did my best with this I like how it came out I had to redo the line though I think this might be my this would be in my top five so my Yuri but anyway you'll see you'll know with the title so yeah so I noticed some more people are starting to watch more of my content thank you to everybody that have showed up I logged in today and I was just like where all these views come from I didn't post this stuff all, all, all online I mean all over the place like I did two years ago I was posting all over reddit and people are watching like for one second it's like watch my content fully like no 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 I may even do a video on that on my experience with advertising on reddit in the terms of YouTube videos but anyway thank you everybody for coming by uh, show up at my please come by my Instagram my obviously my YouTube um, and my deviant art and my twitch they are all named Umi Tencho. see you everybody have a great summer and see you tomorrow with the little gaming thing I'm just gonna be coming out you know it's gonna be technically be the past see ya